three versus four now. And Nexa, he's gonna almost seal the round. Broke it quick with the return though, so still something to play for. Rob's is gonna be sneaking in through the window, and now he's alone. His position absolutely revealed, but if he waits here for another 10 seconds maybe, who knows where he could go with it. Oh, he's gonna fight right away. Trying to put some pressure on Dexter with that AWP on the other side. Flash to set it up. He's running for him, and he's gonna push back into the site. This is it. If he can win this one, he get the bomb plant behind it, and he has an isolated one-on-one, -on -one, but he has no idea Dexter's knockout. Oh, he's so quick! Oh, it's ridiculous. Another good headshot. And now he's just got to wait and see. He's 30 seconds still in the round. And he wants to play a deep mind game. Molotoving it off and walking up. He's got to be careful because Flames is walking up, almost able to spot him if he keeps going. Frozen at the corner, though, and look at this, Rob's. I don't think Flames is going to be quite ready for this. What a sick play from him. He's going to feel like he's been duped all over the map. This is why Rops is such a scary player. This is just such an intelligent reposition from Rops. Even throws the smoke to cover his retreat, knows that's Flames' <laughs> next point of attack, and right there, Flames tries shooting through, and now Rops the chase is up. He is actually playing chess just a couple of moves ahead every single time. You're right, the smoke just is the cherry on top here. And now he's just hiding at the ticket booth. And eventually, Flames will have to just run for it here. He doesn't have the time to look for every position. He doesn't have any nades or anything else to work with here. And Rob's looking to close what he started. A really, really cool one versus three. If he can do it, and there we go! 